This looks interesting. Called Mold, as you can see. Uh, it's a free to play, third person shooter. It looks like Borderlands, honestly. It's a video. Um, everything's all set up. Sweet. Next FPS, 999. We're almost there. We're almost there. Boost game. Um, online or local? Well, I don't know how to play this. So. Let's see what happens if I just do this. Okay. I seem to be missing my pants. Random. Change map. Nexus. Jacinto. Quantum. Cryofrost. Um, I think we'll go with Quantum. Quantum looks pretty. Select character. Aral. Infected. Purchase. Really? I mean, it is a free-to-play game. Alright, we'll just start with the first one. Options. That's the same options again. Alright. I guess we just... Wow. It's a bit blurry. The gates are open. Back to the Citadel. What? I only just got here. Q to show info. Okay, so I need to kill people. That sounded like something closed, but it didn't. Oh, Not friend. Oh, the screen shake is not very nice. The twitching is a good touch. Needs blood. Nothing on the bar at the top suggests that there's any more enemies. Ooh, do we go through here? No. Alright. R did a reload. That's good. I don't seem to be able to interact with anything. What is this? F to activate teleport. 6,000 points. I have, what, 600? Good start. Alright, so top right hand corner says enemies in the zone 9. Wow. Is that an enemy? Nope. Activate trap. 500 points. Alright. Alright, it took like two or three hits on the F button in order to have that register. So that's not a very good start. This looked really good on the Steam store. But like... What am I meant to do? I can't go back in there now. Oh, here we are. Here's some... Um... Right. Ooh. The gates are open back up to the Citadel. Alright, okay, okay, alright, cool. Rare weapons merchant. I gotta walk like almost into him. 4,000 points to refill. Weapon for 2,000. I can't do shit. Increase health. 4,000. There's some people. Hello. Talk to people for 6,000 points. Doctor. Restore health. 500 points. I don't even know what my health is. Bottom right hand corner looks very weird. Legendary weapons merchant. 4,000 points. 6,000 points. Decrease revive time. 4,000 points. Carry extra weapon. 4,000 points. Okay. Enemies in the zone. 13. Epic weapons. Can we go out this way? We can. Alright, let's see how this gun goes. 72.5 degrees. I'm guessing that's Fahrenheit and not Celsius, otherwise we'd all be dead. Okay, well they died a lot quicker. Ooh. Thought you could do a sneaky on me.
Okay, to open back up, 1,400 points. Alright, so I kind of get it. I kind of get the loop. This is it. It's just wave. I'm going to guess it's going to get infinitely harder. Um, yeah, I don't know. Eight hundred points for that one. Nine left. I guess the best strategy is just to wait for everything to come to you. Max ammo. Gates are open back up. We have two thousand five hundred points. So we go in. As soon as you go in, the enemies spawn. Can we swap weapons? We can. Alright, so I'm guessing those big bright orange things are the gates. Ooh, what that? Burst rifle. So I'm guessing it's just a, a normal... Yeah, it's a basic weapon swap. So if a weapon drops, you have to switch to a weapon you don't want and then pick up the new weapon. Wow. Okay. Fuck, this music's So what's the deal with this dude? Right I see. Well. Holy shit. What an intro. Um. Yeah, I reckon this would be really cool with um some friends. Um. Oh, there we are. 
There we go. Legendary weapons. What do we got here? What's this? Pump level four. See, so yeah, I. All oh, right. Okay. Oh, a minigun. I mean. Oh, I don't know. What is that? A gorse cannon. Auto shotgun. Oh. Oh, look at this. Four barrels. Plasma cannon. Hello. I'm trying to buy it. I'm pushing F. It's not working. Oh, there it is. Hello. Welcome home. Alright. Extra weapon. 4,000 points. Oh, I am just... Okay. 20 enemies. Just go to the platform and run around in circles. Oh no, I can't really do that. A bit of overkill. I guess that's why we have traps and all that shit all around the place. Okay. It's got an okay amount of AoE damage. Terribly inefficient for what I'm doing. Ah, it's not too bad, I guess. Zero. Alright. Carry extra weapon. Thank you. Alright. So you got this dude back. So we use this guy for a little while. Look at that thing. That thing looks ridiculous on our back. I love it. you back. Wee. Said, sit down. Oi. Sneaky beaver. Okay, for some reason it still says 20. Did it spawn another 20? gates are open again. Um, it's a pretty cool gameplay loop, but if this is it, um, this would get old and boring pretty fast. Um, I reckon... I, um, I must be missing something. I, I must be missing something. Increase my speed. We got epic weapons. What level are they? Three. Decrease reload time. Hello, you are my best friend. It'd be nice if we had a little bit more of the um, ammo drops. Or just the drops in general. Alright, so there's another 20. Um, boss wave. I'm guessing boss wave at 
10. Alright. Yes, yeah, it seems like a very small play area, really. So there's another 20 on this corner. So do the waves come in like sections of 20 or something? There's another 20. That's out of ammo. Four left. One left. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, so we have a boss. Where's my ammo? Where's the ammo? Oh, right. That's right, this dude. Just a bigger one.
two left. There they are. Or three, actually. For some reason, it counts. It doesn't count the boss. But it affects the counter. Okay. Well. Um... Wow. I very much enjoyed that. Um, I'm smashing the F button, but it ain't doing anything. Can you only do it once? Hmm. What about speed? Looks like you can only do it once. Oh, that's a shame. It kind of makes, um, Makes it a little bit anticlimactic there. There's four there. Very extra weapon. Can't do that anymore. That should just disappear then. Laser crossbow, carbine, heavy rifle. These are all 6,000 though. Um, it's a good start. I think it's fantastic um, with the way it is at the moment um, for a short round when it doesn't really matter too much. Um, I don't know how you're going to go with multiplayer. Um, I'm assuming maybe the enemy scale. Or maybe there's a lot more stuff to do. Uh, I hope so. Only because this is a very, very small play area. Um, I would have thought that like these vendors would be like hidden out in the world somewhere. Um, on your Steam uh, tags... It does actually say that this has procedural generation. So I was thinking along the lines of having this as your main hub when you start. And running through like an uncharted forest or something or an alien world. And you'd have these random little hubs all over the place that you, um, these guys randomly spawn. And you could pick up random power-ups and stuff. That's what I was thinking of. Um, but this seems to be like a good sort of staging area for what... It can be later. Um, and whoever did the music, holy shit. That is amazing. Um, the sound effects are, are, are pretty good as well. Um, I did get stuck on some of the uh, barriers and whatnot. But um, I think that just will come with, with time and polish. But yeah, no, this is fantastic. I really enjoyed this. I was quite surprised. Um, yeah, I... I'd want to see bigger, more dynamic levels um, and a single player offline so that you can at least uh, experiment with builds without being forced to be online or forced to have a group because you don't really want to experiment a build or experiment with guns and then become non-effective in a group if you're forced to do uh, group participation but I don't know how you'd go about that um, like, I would, I would throw like 10, 15 bucks at this game as a buy to play if it had wave based stuff, but on a bigger map with a little bit more interaction and some procedural generation that you go from hub to hub fighting your way through. I reckon that'd be fantastic, but that's just me. But yeah, this was really good. Um, I'm glad I checked it out. Um, it's a free-to-play third-person shooter, online co-op, battle through a variety of maps, endless hordes of ferocious creatures, army cells with multiple weapons available for purchase, and citadels between rounds. Yes, it's mostly positive with 87 reviews, uh, and it was released in April 2022, so I still reckon, I still reckon it's got a chance, especially with all the crap that's out there at the moment. So yeah, awesome. Thanks for watching, I enjoyed this. See you later.